Powered by locally developed AI algorithms, the robot is reported to be able to switch between eight popular languages in the continent. English, Arabic, French, Kiswahili, Pidgin, Wazobia, Afrikaans, and Igbo. It can also interact with well-known gestures in African culture and even be rude. A human, like robot named Omif, is set to be unveiled in Nigeria's capital city of Abuja on Friday. It is the first developed in Africa and was built by Abuja-based Unicon Group, one of the country's fastest-growing tech startups established in 2020. OMEF is set to grace the future of artificial intelligence in the African tech ecosystem, an event that is expected to be attended by regional tech leaders, diplomats, and Nigerian government officials, including the Minister of Communication. It was designed as an Igbo female, capable of speaking eight of the most spoken languages in Africa, along with a deep understanding of African culture and behavioral patterns. The robot can also understand and interact with specific gestures, including smiling, hand illustrations, and other bodily gestures that match the situation and the tone of conversation. It's also aware of words, phrases, and sentences that are considered impolite in African culture. Discussion awareness and real-time understanding, along with politeness and knowledge in various fields and being always teachable, are among the features that make Omethishers that make Ometh special. Ometh can identify human faces and expressions, Pay attention to a specific item when it's required, identify objects and their characteristics, and calculate the position and distance of items it sees. The six-foot multilingual humanoid, as well as its AI algorithms, were developed by Unicon Group STEM Focus Robotics Lab in Abuja within two years. The multi-purpose robot was first presented during the latest Gulf Information Technology Exhibition, Gitex, in October in Dubai, UAU. On October 19, Nigerian President Muhammadu Buhari signed the Nigeria Startup Act, a joint initiative by Nigeria Startup Act, a joint initiative by Nigeria's tech startup ecosystem, the country's tech industry. Minister of Communications and Digital Economy, Isa Pantami described the signing of the act as a major achievement that will significantly enhance the innovation and entrepreneurship ecosystem in Nigeria. Xenobots, or living robots, are small, drop-shaped artificial living organisms with a diameter of no more than one millimeter. They are created from stem cells of a certain species of African frogs. Xenobots first appeared in 2020. During an experiment, the result exceeded expectations. They were able to move, heal themselves, and even work in groups. But as it turned out later, their abilities are not limited to this. Scientists who created the world's first living robots have discovered that they reproduce. Moreover, the form of reproduction they use is absolutely new for animals and plants. It is called kinematic replication. Previously, scientists observed it exclusively at the molecular level. According to the authors of the work, they themselves were amazed by this discovery. When it comes to robots, we always imagine complex metal mechanisms, but as the study's lead author Josh Bongard, a professor at the University of Vermont says, it doesn't matter what the robot is made of. What matters is what he knows how to do, namely, whether he can perform any actions by himself and solve certain tasks set by a person. Given this definition, xenobots are robots as they are created to perform certain actions. But at the same time, they are also a living organism, since they are created from frog stem cells. Stem cells do not have a specific purpose, but they can transform into any specialized cell. The peculiarity of stem cells is that they are non-specialized cells that can differentiate into specialized ones. 
In other words, they initially do not have a specific purpose, but they can change and replace any specialized cells. To create xenobots, the authors took samples of living stem cells from frog embryos, after which they gave them the opportunity to incubate. Xenobots have a spherical shape and include approximately 3,000 cells. Their development is still at the very initial stage. They were created simply as an experiment and have no practical application. They cannot even be called a technology yet, but rather a phenomenon similar to the first computers that appeared in the 1940s of the last century. However, as the creators of living robots suggest, the combination of molecular biology and artificial intelligence is a promising direction that will allow solving many problems of humanity in the future. For example, they can collect microplastics in the oceans. The study was funded by DAPRA, few people know, but it was this agency that gave the world the internet. The technologies that DAPRA oversees are partly for military purposes. What is not food for thought for conspiracy theorists? Nevertheless, xenobots are beginning to surprise scientists now. As it turned out, they are able to reproduce their own kind. As stated in a study published in the PANAS edition, xenobots are created from stem cells of the African clawed frog. Self Reproduction of xenobots is an extremely rare phenomenon that occurs under certain circumstances. As I said above, the method of reproduction used by them is called kinematic replication. Previously, it was only seen at the molecular level. The principle boils down to the fact that the molecules use certain suitable blocks from which they create similar molecules. Xenobots reproduce on the same principle as molecules. They find suitable cells and build groups of them similar to themselves. It should be noted that this process does not require any actions at the genetic level. Previously, scientists have never observed such a phenomenon either in groups or in single cells. Having discovered this phenomenon, scientists decided to increase the rate of reproduction. To do this, they gave xenobots the optimal shape for kinematic replication. It turned out that this is a C-shaped shape, strikingly similar to the character of the legendary pack. Man game, your mouth recess. They use it to collect material to form a new xenobot. Thanks for watching. Put likes and subscribe to the channel.